Hey guys, it's early, um, but I haven't posted a video in a while, and first thing in the morning is probably the only time I'll ever have time to do it. Um, just wanted to give you guys an update and also um, sort of respond to Yvette's uh, message on uh, my, YouTube's, my YouTuber name and also show my tattoos. So, uh, first things first, I got a job working at a teacher's union, um, working at a, an academic publication that they put out four times a year. Um, it's a temp job. I'm actually filling in for somebody who is going on maternity leave. So um, I'll be uh, one, whoring myself there to uh, see if I can get a full-time gig and um, also in a couple months you know, revamping the job search. But it'll pay the bills and, and keep food in my stomach for now. Um, I have uh, also decided that I'm uh, going back to school. Oh, my God. Ugh. Sorry about that. That was my alarm. Uh, I've also decided I'm going back to school. I'm uh, going to go to the University of the District of Columbia here in D.C. And I'm going to study um, some more nutrition classes. I'm going to be taking chemistry and body statistics and a bunch of really exciting stuff. Um, so that I sent off my application, but it's a it's a public school, so I'm, I'm not really concerned about getting in. But the classes start in January. Anyway, um, so anyway, my name is the Drunken Hippie here on YouTube, and that is, is a kind of uh, mini folded thing. Um, I grew up in California, and um, according to seems like everybody else. Everyone in California is a, a dirty, stinky hippie, especially at uh, the school I went to. So um, that's part of it. Drunken hippie is um, the every night I would um, have some uh, some wine and some beer to go with my studies, and so did everybody else. It seems you know it's, it seemed like instead of pizza, we all got uh, a couple bottles of wine and, and and studied and got all that stuff done. So. Um, and on top of that is, um, presently I struggle with alcohol abuse, and even though I'm not quite sure if, um, I should ever drink again, or if I should never drink again, or that, um, I, I keep it in my name because it's part of me. And, um, I know a lot of people, when they change a lifestyle, they change their YouTube name. Um, but I'm not going to do that because I think that it's part of me, it's part of my evolution, it's part of um, life. I need some coffee. It's morning. Can you tell we have election fever here in, in D.C.? I tell you, the Obama parties have been crazy. Like, people par are still partying. I can't go to the grocery store without some party in a parking lot. It's, it's, it's crazy out of here. Hopefully it'll get really cold soon, and then, you know, it won't be so bad. Um, and I was also going to show my um, tattoos. Now, my tattoos have uh, a lot to do with metamorphosis and uh, evolution, um, especially of the self. Um, I'll show them first. I have two. This is my first tattoo. I got it when I was 18. Of course, it's a monarch butterfly. And then my um, other tattoo is um, is a frog. Now I um, I designed them both myself, um, drew them both myself, and had the tattoo artist put them on. Um, and the reason I chose a butterfly and a frog is because they um, metamorphosize into completely different forms, from a caterpillar to a butterfly, and from a tadpole to a uh, frog. So I, uh, it's, you know, it's it's like I, I've, I'm still changing, and, and my final form will be something completely different from what I started out as. Now I want, I've wanted um, in the middle of my back a large sea turtle of the same style, and I've designed it a couple times, but I don't think that's ever going to happen, um, just because the husband doesn't really like tattoos. I had um, quite a few piercings when I met him and he was just not into it and eventually they just sort of went away so which is I guess is good because it's kinda of hard to find a job with um, you know 
when you, when your resume shows a college degree and you show up and you're a little scuzzy, so I guess that's good. Um, but the reason I, I want a sea turtle is because sea turtles travel miles and miles and miles to um, lay eggs on the sand. And these eggs, you know, there's hundreds of them, and they hatch, and they basically run the gauntlet from the from the the beach to into the sea. Um, they're picked up by seagulls and tourists, and uh, dogs eat them, and sometimes they just dry out and die. And hundreds and hundreds of them are hatched, but only a few make it to the sea. But the ones that do make it to the sea live for a hundred years, not two hundred years. So, um, that is why I want the sea turtle. It's never going to happen. So, um, again, Yvette, thanks for, for the book review. I really appreciate it. Um, still thinking about getting it. Um, so, I'm, but I, I'm going to, I don't know, I, I think I'm going to wait a week or two for the 2009 kit to see if there's something similar in the package and then make my choice then. Um, especially since I just started a new job from a period of unemployment and buns are a little tight. Buns are really tight. So, um, there'll be some Avon looks and some reviews and things like that coming. Just, I just have to find the time. Um, I know I got a lot of great requests from my last contest that I did and, um, those things are coming. So, um, I will talk to you again, guys, later. Bye!